Here's the same phrase played slowly. So this phrase is a bit of a finger twister. It will mess around with you for a bit, but once you get it down, this kind of pivoting motion that's happening on the bottom is really cool because you can move around all sorts of notes on top, but the fact that that's staying constant is keeping it all kind of grounded. Um, and also the fact that we're kind of pivoting on the fifth in the key of G, um, which is D. Uh, the fifth in the scale is a, it's not a very note that really dictates a whole lot. It's not like a third or something that's very um, out sounding. It's, it sounds kind of like home base, except for the only thing that's maybe more home would be the root note. Um, so the fact that we're doing it on the fifth is very important. Um, but also, it's just really fun to be able to move around and have this constant motion above like that. So mess around with your own rhythmic phrases. Mess around with outside notes. You can throw in um, like an E note, which would be a 13 in the key of G. Mess around with some other notes like that. You can throw in a 9, which would be uh, A. Just try messing around with different notes and, and keep that bottom pivot happening.